Hey guys, welcome back to another Battleful video. This time we are on Panzerstorm. Haven't uploaded a lot on this map, so I thought I'd give it a go. And I'm using the Gewehr 43. I used this gun a lot at the start when the game was first released. Um, I've slept in it for quite a while, so I thought I will try it and see if it's all beastly. And it's still pretty good. Using the uh, three times scope or two times scope again. Easy mode. Attention, we have lost objective box. Yeah, still having a few issues on console at the moment with the game stuttering and things like that, but I think Dice are aware of it and trying to work on it. But it's still. I've seen more problems on Xbox, really, to be honest, than, um, than PlayStation, so. Hopefully they'll fix it soon because it's unplayable in some rounds. And you'll probably see in the video, sometimes my gun just keeps jolting up as I'm walking. I don't know if that's a bug or not. But yeah, the gun, uh, the gunplay and just running around the map in general feel, feels still a bit, a bit sloppy, if I'm honest. But I'm trying to get some gameplay again with it. I'm looking to um, try and play the new Fortress game mode in the next couple of days as well. I've seen a few streamers play it and it looks... Hmm. Looks, looks a bit MMG friendly again, I think. But I think every map is like that. Especially Hamada. I think when you're attacking, trying to get up, it's going to be difficult. Thanks, shotgun. Didn't see him lying there. How did I miss him? <laughs> but, um, yeah, I think it's going to be a bit difficult attacking because the defence have automatically got the high ground and it doesn't look like there's a lot of um, flanking opportunities. So, But I'll give it a go. I've got to play it. I've only watched it, so... Hopefully it'll be okay. It's only on two maps, I believe, though, which is a bit, a bit disappointing. But again, it's only limited, so a bit different, I suppose. Pistol game. But yeah, hopefully in the next few weeks I'll be getting a, a better PC, so I'll be hopefully be able to render my videos at, at well a lot of higher quality. Sorry. Because um, the PC I've got at the moment isn't very good, which is why I can only record at this quality, but hopefully in the next few weeks I'll be getting a new PC. Time to up the quality of the video, I believe. Yeah, I'm quite surprised how long I've left it to use this gun, because I was using it, I was like, Ooh. it is nice. I think I pref preferred over the last few months use a Turner because you can spam that a little bit more due to the magazine. You've got to be a bit more careful with this gun with the, just the ten in the in the clip. But if your aim is good and you're hitting your shots, then it is very good. Like a lot of the assault weapons in this game. Not today, mate. You're not reviving him. I hope um, everyone's enjoying the Tides of War challenge this week. There's a big reward available for 5,000 coins. <laughs> what are they thinking? I think they should have given us like one of the elites or something like that as a reward. Like, I'd rather work towards an elite than coins that won't really go anywhere. It's so not really into buying the skins or anything. But yeah, having one of the elite soldiers to, you know, even if you could choose, or if you just get one of them, like, for people who, who don't want to pay, like, whatever the, the amount is at the minute, for an elite, for a skin, you know, they could have, they could have given us one of those, but, with the way this game's going, 
so far. Doesn't surprise me at all. But it's coins. The thing is, they know people will do it. The people like to grind the Tides of War because that's the only thing to grind, really, at the moment, for people who are level 50, so... Let's see my gun stutter in there. The pistol's just, like, going up. I don't know why it's doing that. Yeah, I don't know what they did with the, the last update. Like, I don't know if they tested it or not. Obviously not. Just a bit... A bit sloppy on their end, but kind of getting used to that now, I think. But anyway, I don't want to say, well, too much hate, I should say, towards DICE, because they do make a very good game. It's just Battle Fiber has been a bit, bit of an odd one, really. Bit of an odd one. Just looking forward to playing the new map that comes out in a couple of weeks because as much as I do like the base maps, you know, for uploads, you know, I'm uploading the same map pretty much. Because this time we're normally used to having premium, so. And the premium maps, like three or four maps coming out at once. But not at the moment. I think even if I, I do like the premium model, I did like it, sorry, but even if you know they wanted to go on this tides of war thing that they're doing, like one map a month wouldn't be too bad, would it? But to have no maps in like six months or whatever it is since the release of the game, it's a bit. It's not really that that great, is it? A map every few weeks or every month would be would kind of work and keep it fresh. Lovely bipoded MMG or LMG in that case, the Bren. The yeah, I definitely want to use this gun a lot more and go back to it a little bit. And I want to. Um, I haven't really played a lot due to the issue with, with my Xbox, well, not my Xbox, but with the game on Xbox. You know, I wanted to unlock the PO8 and get a gameplay on that, but I haven't had a chance to, well, one, I haven't had a chance, and two, it's difficult playing this game sometimes. With this with this latest update, it's, it's not, it's not fun, to be fair. But it didn't feel as bad as it did when I last played the game on these couple of games that are uploaded in the video. It wasn't too bad. A couple of stutters here and there, but overall, a lot better than it has been. Look at these two. Look at these two. Play them at their own game. Funnest playstyle in Battlefield 5. See jolt, jolts then a little bit. So I hope that it'll be fixed. And anyway guys, that's the end of the video. Leave a like and I will see you in the next one.